Hey guys, so today in this video I'm just going to be revisiting some of my cloud mining sites. Um, Hash Flare, Miner Gate, and Miner Farm. See what they're doing, whether their profitability has gone up or down. Um, stuff like that, I got numbers and everything else on it. Um, if you're new to this channel, uh, new here watching this video, be sure to like and subscribe the video and hit the bell icon for future notifications. And with that guys, let's dive right into the video and see what the numbers are. Alright, so here we are. Um, like I said, we're going to be reviewing Hash Flare. Here's my dashboard. Uh, Miner Farm in the dashboard as well. And Miner Gate in the dashboard as well. Just so you guys know, I actually do have accounts here and I'm not making this stuff up. So let's pull out the spreadsheet. Um, these are all still the same as far as price per 100 giga hash. That hasn't changed. Uh, Hashflare still has that deal going on. I'll show you that in a sec. Um, so as of the 20th today, uh, total fees on Miner Farm are 77%. That's gone up a percent. That's why it's in red. Hashflare is at 56.4%, which has gone up 6.4%. Again, why that's in red. And Miner Gate actually went down a little bit, 2.4%. That's why it's in green. So, overall, Miner Gate, um, as far as fee, if you want to look at the fees and everything else, is the only one that went down. Uh, so, the ROIs are still, this would have gone up a little bit, this gone up, and this would have gone down. It wasn't that big of a deal as far as days concerned, so I didn't really figure it in, but those are pretty close estimates um, of as far as the ROI if you did decide to invest in those 100 giga hash. So let's just look at the BTC value at Miner Gate. We'll start there, see what that is right now. I know it says 267, but this is always fluctuating, so I think I already did this. Yeah. So two dollars and forty-two cents. I'm holding in Miner Gate right now. Miner Farm. This is my balance. It's still only free. I have not upgraded to gotten any more hashing power in there. Let's see what that is. Three dollars and sixteen cents. I got in there. And let's roll over to Hashflare and see what I got there. $96.94. Something that has been really tempting to me um, is this discount on top of their low, low um, hash rate as far as to purchase from Hashflare. It's almost too good to pass up. So, I mean, look, price per 10 giga hash is still $1.20. So, I think I figured out earlier I could do 880, 890. Let's go, let's try and, I think I'm gonna do this right now on video. I think I'm gonna upgrade 900 giga hash that will give me 6.12 tera hash so let's proceed then i will enter the coupon to get an additional 10 percent off click redeem let's see if i have enough that's 97.20 how much did it said 96.94 so i don't have enough in there so let's cancel that Let's go back over here again. Buy hash rate, SHA-256. So now let's go to 890 giga hash. That should let me be able to purchase it. Let's click proceed. Redeem code. Right there. And we are at 96.12. What did I have? 96.94, that should be enough. Select payment, pay with BTC. Number of pre 
purchase is Hester has risen. So let me see if that will let me purchase it. Click confirm. We'll see here. Live on camera. Well, I thought I had enough. So let me go back. Alright, so I know what I did. I um, hit pay with these BTC instead of my balance. So again, let's proceed. Redeem code. Should drop it down to where I have my balance. 9504. Select payment method. Pay from balance instead of pay with BTC. I confirm. Click confirm. Let me see if it goes through. Purchase was successful. Good. So now my BTC is 0 0.0002. 6.1 terahash right now. So let's go over to the calculator and see what I can expect from doing that. 6.1 terahash. So six one zero zero. We're not paying for power at all. Pool fees. Pool fees is at fifty six percent. Calculate. That's as of right now with the Bitcoin difficulty and the price of Bitcoin being as low as it is. So let's scroll down. 618 dollars a year. So these pool fees if they ever go down we should be all right. But I officially now have 6.1 terahash of uh, Bitcoin cloud mining in Hashflare. Uh, I wanted to actually this year one of my goals is to get to 10 terahash so I'm getting there but anyways guys um, I guess this is it for the cloud mining review at least a kind of a weekly update I think I'm gonna do this every week just give a bit of a review of uh, the fees and everything else and see what goes up and see what goes down. I think next time I'll actually get into the ROI on these per 100 giga hash just to give everyone an idea of what they can expect. Alright guys, um, thanks for watching. I'll have another video coming out later today uh, with my mining rig update. Um, I did get another card, so I do have two cards coming in now. Should be coming in the end of this month. Um, Thanks again for watching. Again, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon uh, so you'll be notified of that video coming out. And if you like the video, hit the like icon, uh, like button. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, uh, please put them in the comment section below and I will be sure to get back to you. All right, guys. Thanks again. Take care.